In the quiet streets of Spokane, Washington, in the crisp September of 1992, the life of Roseanne Pleasant was shrouded in mystery. Her last known interaction was with William Bradley, also known as Brad, a figure now entwined with her disappearance. Roseanne's life was a tapestry of struggles, battling the demons of substance abuse while nurturing her youngest daughter, Valerie, a mere two years old at the time. Whispers of her plans to flee south with her children echoed in the corridors of her troubled existence, a glimmer of hope in the darkness that engulfed her. Yet fate had its own cruel designs. Just seven days after her last sighting, Roseanne vanished into the ether, leaving behind a void of unanswered questions and shattered dreams. The specter of her perilous lifestyle, entangled with drugs and prostitution, cast a long shadow over her fate. A grim precursor to her disappearance haunted her as she previously bore witness to the chilling demise of a comrade in her work. Among the suspects, the spotlight fell heavily upon Brad Jackson, her boyfriend, and a man with a tumultuous past. Allegations of abuse and fear emanated from Roseanne's own kin, painting a chilling portrait of domestic turmoil. Jackson's refusal to cooperate with the authorities only fueled suspicions, as did his troubled history with the law. Years later, tragedy revisited the Jackson household in a twist of fate. Valerie, the innocent beacon of light amidst the darkness, met a harrowing end snatched away from the world under sinister circumstances. Suspicion, once again, turned its gaze towards Brad Jackson, whose troubled conscience finally cracked under the weight of guilt. Confession spilled forth, revealing a heart-witching tale of a father's descent into madness, yet the truth remained elusive. Obscured by shadows of doubt and deceit, Speculations swirled as authorities pieced together the puzzle of Valerie's demise, unearthing damning evidence of foul play. In the hushed corridors of justice, Brad Jackson stood condemned, a man shackled by the chains of his own making. His conviction echoed through the annals of time, a grim testament to the darkness that lurks within the human soul. As the years rolled by, Roseanne's fate remain a haunting enigma, her memory forever etched in the heart of those who knew her. Yet amidst the shadows of uncertainty, one truth remained steadfast. The legacy of Roseanne Pleasant, a woman lost to the sands of time, but never forgotten. At the time of her disappearance, Roseanne Pleasant stood five feet nine and weighed 145 pounds. She had black, dark brown hair and brown eyes. Roseanne's ears are pierced. She wore a size large in tops, size 34 by 30 pants, and a size nine and a half shoe, and she was known to use the last names Stone or Jackson. If you or anyone you may know that may have any information that may lead to the whereabouts of Roseanne, please don't hesitate to reach out to the Spokane, Washington Police Department or your local authorities, and please help bring Roseanne home.